to the courthouse now in one of the only cases continuing as the province's courts essentially shut down to limit the spread of COVID-19. Kaylin Schlater has been found guilty of first degree murder in the killing of Tess Ritchie in 2017. I'm Mark Douglas from 680 News outside the University Avenue Courthouse where a dark, dark chapter in Toronto's uh, crime history has come to a close. Kaylin Schlater has been found guilty of first degree murder for the death of Tess Ritchie. She was discovered by her own mother in an alley in Toronto back in November of 2017. The jury passing down their verdict only this afternoon. Outside the courthouse, Tess's mother gave a very emotional, understandably emotional reaction. We'll never be happy, we'll never be complete again, but we can try to heal from here and do things in Tessie's name. So thank you all for the support. It's been a rough road, but thank we you. made it. We also heard from the Toronto homicide detective who brought Kalen Schlater to justice. Kalen Schlater is a predator, he's a murderer, and I want the jury to know, again, that they made the right decision and justice was served. Kalen was the type of person that was going after what he was looking for. Uh, unfortunately, Tess was at the wrong place at the wrong time. And, and unfortunately, the circumstances are uh, what, what happened. So it's very sad circumstances. The Superior Court Justice noted that he kept this trial going despite the COVID-19 shutdowns of pretty much every other court case in, uh, in the city of Toronto. And uh, after deliberations with uh, both the Crown and defense attorneys, they have all decided that sentencing will begin for Kalen Schlater Wednesday morning back here at 361 University Avenue. At the Superior Courthouse, I'm Mark Douglas from 680 News.